believe the Covey Center has more than met the expectations of the Arts Council. It has done many things independent of the city budget, which was better than we expected. It's exceeded the expectations. We're at a 90% plus booking rate in our main hall and the amount of users and visitors to Covey Center far exceed what we thought when we were building the prospectus for this facility. It's one of the most successful art centers both in use and in efficiency and operational expenses. So it's something that we're really proud of and we consider it as one of our flagship facilities in Provo. The Covey Center has benefited its most simply by being there. It's nice to have a multi-purpose venue because it sets itself up as a kind of a center. If you're looking for theaters in Utah, it houses more than a lot of the theaters around do, so you can get a great audience in for your venue. But it has the ability to feel intimate. So because of the way that the mezzanine and the balcony are set up, the audience feels close to you. So it feels like you're playing an intimate house, but you're actually playing to a pretty large crowd. The Covey Center has allowed us to do professional quality performances that we're not able to do anywhere else. We have a lot of technical aspects and we have huge sets and drops and all of these things that are part of our big ballets and there's nowhere else in the state that allows us to have a seamless, beautiful performance like the Covey. I love the Covey Center because it's just the perfect size um, you know, for the shows we do, uh, what we do here. Um, the staff is really helpful and friendly and and uh, you know the, the setup is uh, really great. It's always you know has a nice feel to it. You know it kind of feels nice and welcome, welcoming, and it's also you know kind of has an artsy flavor to it. So I think you know combined all that together, it's a uh, big enough to do a lot of really great great events. We love performing at the Covey because of the technical aspects we can get here, which we're not able to get other places, and the staff is so friendly. The box office. Paul and his crew, and Pam and her crew. We just love everyone here so much. I'm always impressed at how helpful and professional the staff was. We're just so grateful, particularly for Pam here at the Covey. She's always so fun and funny, and she just makes our shows run so smoothly. And her lighting design is brilliant and beautiful, and we just feel so lucky that we get to work with her. And the crew is just awesome. Pam and John and all the Covey crew and, and their talent and their ability and their knowledge of the facility when you come in really creates a top-notch event. The Covey Center has helped my students and our performers in Vocal Point uh, because every year, truthfully every semester, what we work toward is our performances at the Covey Center. They are the highlight of the semester for us. They are our hometown shows. So everyone that comes through the Vocal Point program knows that the Covey Center is what we kind of are gearing our whole semester around. The Covey Center isn't just about theater. We have concerts, dance performances, classes. You know, people can sign up for ballet lessons or for different kinds of art lessons, whatever, and they can be taught by people who've been there and done that in New York City or wherever. And I think that's a great talent for us to have. The community feeling here at the Covey Center brings together artists of really high caliber. We've brought in people like Styx, America. Stomp, Anne of Green Gables. Foreigner, the Beach Boys. The Fantastics, and lots more. It's an awesome partnership. It's just a beautiful theater. We don't want to perform anywhere else. We would be here every day if we could. <laughs> I can see the Covey Center in 10 years doing amazing things. I am so excited for where the Covey Center is headed. If you think the last 10 years have been great, wait to see what we have planned for the next 10.